as the replacement for the last generation Panamera Turbo S range topper, the Turbo SE Hybrid stands at the forefront of Porsche's new, performance-oriented hybrid strategy. Alongside the 2015 Porsche 918 Spider, it's tasked with burnishing the credibility of gas electric powertrains as performance aids. No one will protest if and when Top Dog Can and McCann's Downey hybrid badges in the near future, but read between the lines and it's apparent that Porsche also is greasing the skids for the inevitable hybridized 911. Our glimpse of Porsche's performance future started with five laps of the one-year-old Hermitilk design circuit. The tightly coiled 1.4-mile track plays out through frenetic elevation changes more reminiscent of a roller coaster than any other track we've driven. Willowy golden grasses cover the swollen hillsides, helping to obscure the track's many blind turns, which are made significantly less challenging and thrilling than it could be when every hidden apex turns out to be exactly where you expect it. And while we cornered at a relatively relaxed pace, the Turbo SE Hybrid's 680 horsepower can make even the slowest lead follow exercise feel quick. The car fires out from every apex with the ferocity of a round from an assault rifle. Porsche bundles the full kit of chassis magic as standard in the Turbo SE Hybrid, including adaptive dampers and anti-roll bars, an electronically controlled limited slip differential, and carbon ceramic brakes. The $195,850 long wheel